Yeah. Right there, I think. What do you think? Yeah. A little bit of the front seat, a little bit of light. Okay, and we can see our voice. I can hear my voice. Can you hear my voice? That's all I can hear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it takes more time setting up to do the filming than just to do the filming, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, it does ever. Oh, hey, everybody. Hey, oh, welcome well, here. Welcome to our conversation. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, we have guests. Oh, anyway. Honey, we're being, we're being watched. Yeah. yeah. Well, we hope we're being watched. Anyways. Um, Feel like the babysitter who's being recorded and they don't know it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's just creepy. And, <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyways, we, in case you don't know who we are and you're turning in for the first time, we are Rob and Jan Can Van. And ta da, we're in our van. So we can van and we're yep. Rob and Jan. And we also, it also stands for Rob and Jan Canada Van Life, if you didn't know that. And for some reason, our camera's reversed, so it's confusing me looking at me over there. But no, yeah, like it's like when it I put my head this way, it's actually, oh, it went the other way. That's what I'm saying. It's like everything's reversed. I'm confused. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's Idle not make this too long. Yeah. Uh, so we got a few things to talk about today. Yep. We're going to do our poem first. So if you watched our video earlier this week, uh, we hinted about a slim chance of a poem coming out with our coffee in the van. This is coffee in the van number five. Uh, so we said there's going to be a slim chance of a poem and there is a poem. So I'm going to read it for you shortly. Then we're going to discuss in that video also earlier this week, which is entitled, well, now I'm not sure anymore. It's about the roof rack anyways. Yeah. So we'll put a little picture of it somewhere here. I don't know which way I'm finding. Yeah, there's just a couple um, of uh, little details that uh, may have gotten missed or not explained yeah. properly that uh, I'll just uh, touch on. Yeah, exactly. And, uh, and then we're gonna talk about our big exciting news we've been alluding to for a couple of weeks now. So we're gonna talk about that because we're gonna I'll tell it, aren't we? We're gonna spill the beans, right? Yeah. Spill yeah. the beans. The beans, the beans, yeah. So first, without further ado, I'm gonna read my poem. Go for it. I'm gonna if I can see I'm it. gonna have a drink. This is coffee in the van, but once again we're drinking water, so just water. pretend it's coffee Nectar in the van. Nectar of the gods. Nectar of yeah. the gods. I'm gonna get my iPad out so I can read it. Maybe I'll just read it. Where can I put this where it's not in the way? Oh it's gonna be in the way. Yeah. I'll just read it down a bit like this. Do you like how I've how I've finagled my iPad case. I think I need a new one. I've got it like gorilla taped. Just hold it together. Duct tape. <laughs> okay, so here right. is our poem. We're well, not our poem. It's my poem. He doesn't write any poems. He doesn't even write in chat. <laughs> yeah, he does have opinions though. All right. Are we? <laughs> okay, here Sarcasm. it goes. Sarcasm. Here it goes. A fellow Canadian close to our age, a YouTuber icon who's all the rage, a simple cook making meals on the fly, vegetarian based Albertan guy, drinking water from streams, filtering as you go, driving in your Jeep with your trailer in tow, exploring the lands, hiking in the wild, tutorials and tests you've compiled, alone but not lonely, traversing the north, while taking your trailer back and forth. Drinking a beer, enjoying the sunset, a down-to-earth guy as you can get. Can you guess who this is from all that's been said? Yes, you guessed it. It's Slim Potato Head. But wait, some exciting news has been released. Slim is moving from west to east. Where will, where, where will you end up? We don't know. Maybe you'll pass through Ontario. Slim, stop for a cold one. Let's make it a plan. Cheers to you from Rob and Jan, Can Van. Should have done, you should do cheers. Woo! Cheers. Plunk. Cheers. Yeah. So there, that's for Slim Potato Head. Yeah. So. Yeah. If, it, if uh, anybody's not familiar with him, uh, check him out. Slim Potato Head. Yeah. And, he's been uh, around a long time. Yeah. Yeah. yeah he has. He's really cool. Travels around. He's had a he had a pointy trailer. What are those? <laughs> trailers. He had a trailer that's like a frame. A frame. Oh. He had an a frame trailer, and then he went to like a different style. This is a family show. Stop it. Anyway, so uh, now, oh, I'll take off my granny glasses now. So he, um, he's, we started watching him a few years ago. He's been around a long time. He does little tips and tricks. He does like kind of backcountry camping. Yeah. He does uh, boondocking and um, yeah, just really informative, fun, sarcastic, likes to enjoy nature and be out there and is really an advocate for living kind of the right way for nature and the yeah your own lifestyle type yeah, of thing. Yeah. yeah yeah no he's entertaining so, so definitely worth a watch check him out if uh, you haven't and yeah. uh, uh you won't just be on an angle 
On an angle? It's no, like possibly. looking on an angle. Doesn't matter. People, you just watch a little bit like this if we're on an angle. We're just uh, a hair <laughs> out of square. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, now you got to talk about the roof rack. Okay, the roof racks. Uh, yeah, in the last video, uh, I showed how uh, they went in, how we built them, uh, and all that type of thing. And then I mentioned that uh, we were just spraying them with Rhino Guard uh because uh the powder coating if you try to have that done because of the length of them and uh, the normal expansion of uh, aluminum which i guess is quite a bit uh there's a potential of this uh coating cracking so anyway one of the things that i've tried to do with the van here is that uh whenever i've done things with finishes and that i would prefer to have a finish that i can reapply should i need to so that's why we sprayed them black because if i want to do any modifications to that in the future for eyelets or whatever to hold uh, tarps or uh, you know anything of that nature then I can do them and then uh, just get a can of this stuff and uh, spray it and it looks like it was uh, uh, done originally uh, yep. the other thing is is that the uh, the solar panels were put on a tray and the reason that that was done that way is that uh, uh, the new tray extends beyond the uh, edge of the solar panels so that when they're bolted onto the main part of the roof rack they're accessible so if I ever want to take them off all I have to do is release the four bolts I don't have to go underneath uh, the three inch and try to get wrenches in there and all that stuff mm -hmm. and the other consideration is in the future which isn't one of mine at this point and I don't know if it ever will be but that would allow you to uh, modify it so that you could in theory unscrew the two front ones lift it up and tilt it which is a consideration in Canada. I can't see where my hand's going here. I anyway, know it's opposite. I yeah, it's opposite, you. yeah. So anyway, <laughs> uh, in the future, should it need be, uh, I could look at that. It's nothing that I'm really uh, considering, but the option is there, so. And overall, are you happy with the end result? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's good. Uh, we haven't really tested it yet because uh, uh, that's, a se that's a segue to Oh, that's a segue. That's a segue. We have tested things. it, but... We have tested it, yes, but not uh, 100%, but uh, that's... Oh. Before we go on to the next topic, I just want to say congratulations for wearing a different shirt this week, Rob. <laughs> so, we put out the video on Monday this week. No, not that one. Was that that one? No. Anyways, two videos in a row. Oh, yeah, our Collingwood video hanging out in Collingwood or chilling in Collingwood and then our coffee in the van number four I realized we realized after we filmed edited got it uploaded he's wearing the same shirt he's wearing now luckily the one time he's wearing a white undershirt like a white t-shirt underneath the shirt but he wore the same really loud bold pattern shirt black and white shirt two vid videos in a row well, they so. didn't know I owned two of them it's not two of them it's the same shirt <laughs> right. anyways <laughs> Anyway, okay, get so on that, was, that was funny. Okay, so, drum roll. Um, we are... Are you going to say it, or am I going to say it? Are we both going to say it? Yeah, okay, you go ahead. Well, what, are you, what are you going to say? I want to see what he oh, says. I was going to say we're homeless. <laughs> well, we're houseless. Houseless. houseless but not yes. homeless, because yeah. this is our home. So, as of August, we won't say the exact date, but yeah. um, we sold our condo. We're doing this full time, guys. Yeah. So now. Exciting and terrifying. Yeah. Now, now we're trying to burden our children with all the crap we've collected over how oh many my years. God. We have so much work <laughs> over the next while. We sold some of the, we sold some of the furniture with the condo to make it easier, and uh, we're loaning and giving some of our stuff to our kids. We're putting a little bit in storage, but in our kids' homes ish. Like we're we're kind of still work. It's a work in progress, but. We've got a lot of work to do over the next month or so to yeah. get ready, and so it's going to be busy, but we are doing it. We've decided life is too short. We were going to wait. Originally, things, well, the COVID in the last year or two, me having cancer and then COVID and everything happening over the last couple of years, all of our plans have kind of been pretend because every time we seem to plan something, the plans fall through. So we've been yeah. kind of just winging this and deciding what to do and we didn't know whether to rent our condo or just go away for short periods of time and kind of do things that way but we decided the market's good right now and we want to be in here we don't know if we're going to do it for six months or six years or a lifetime but we're doing it because we got this great van we enjoy being in it and we just want to get out there so stay tuned we'll be maybe coming to a 
town or city near you at some point. <laughs> yeah, yeah right? it's, it's, a, it's a big change uh, because, yeah. you know, typically uh, everybody thinks that their uh, the, the value in their life is uh, tied to their real estate, but, uh, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, everybody has a different opinion. And uh, personally, I'm tired of paying condo fees. And taxes. Taxes. Taxes and, alone. Oh my Lord. So taxes alone. I know. I know it's probably different. Some of the countries where that are people from different countries and from the United States, different areas. Um, so we have a condo. So there's five other stories above us. So it's not like we own a big piece of property. We own the within our boundaries. We don't of even our own property. any property. Right. So well, you own the condo yeah. in within the walls. Yeah. So we're paying almost five thousand dollars a year in taxes, just in taxes. Yeah for that property five times six because there's six stories in this yeah. condo <laughs> well we don't pay times six no, but no, they're getting uh, it yeah. the government so the municipality is. yeah and for we don't really i mean there's garbage there that's we're not yeah. really gaining a lot from that and then and then condo fees again there's not really many amenities there and we're paying 540 something dollars a month in condo fees so we're over a thousand dollars a month just in those kind of fees before yeah. we even get started so we decided we're gonna we're just gonna do this we're gonna see how it works we're gonna wing it and we're gonna try and make some plans but right now things are not quite open here in Canada so we're still kind of figuring it out but we're just gonna make mm -hmm. it so we have everything sorted out in the van we're gonna live as minimally as we can yeah. and uh, figure it out as we go yeah we'll put everything in the van that we know that we need yeah. or that we want uh, uh, as, a, as a permanent residence mm -hmm. and then uh, everything else will be given away sold or uh something to be done with it yeah, uh, so donate, we don't donate yeah, it, we don't um, have the responsibility yeah. for it anymore because yep. ultimately at the end of the day when we get in the van we go ah oh, jesus this feels good and we don't have any responsibility for this monstrosity of uh commitment that uh you know that y you only take y you only actually ever take advantage probably of 10 or 15 percent of what you your real estate or whatever that you have or well not just that uh, i think when you're the you more know? inside you are and the more you stay in your home you end up watching more tv you end yeah. up kind of living yeah. in your home living inside and the whole point of being in the van is to live outside of the van so the van is your vehicle to to see the world your van is your vehicle to get you to point a to point b and it's the journey of your life it's your it's your journey and so we're actually doing our kids a favor too because the more crap we get rid of now the less they have to deal with when we're gone so we're yeah. doing them a favor yeah yeah just get rid of everything and spend our inheritance thinking out loud again <laughs> anyway on that's, another note and that's pretty much, oh what's your other note i'm uh, dying to know because i didn't think we we're covering anything else what were you gonna I'm say just, i'm just trying to evade that last statement so you don't really have another note <laughs> no no notes no notes except uh onward and forward and uh that, that's our plans uh yeah. and uh, not unlike everybody else you know you, we've all had plans that have been uh modified or over uh, and over again we've crushed changed plans, or yeah. whatever and yeah. uh, uh for, for us personally uh uh, with respect to our uh, property that we just got rid of, uh, ultimately I don't think we'd want to be there. We like the, the it's building. Nice. Oh, it's, it's nice. Ni oh, we, it was we, nice. We like it, and it was. It, it is nice. It's just that we don't yeah. want to live in a condo. We want to live out in the world, and that's what it comes down to. We want to enjoy this yeah. life. We don't know how much time we have in this world. Yeah. Nobody, nobody it's, does. It's not our lifestyle. And we just it, want to be able to enjoy it. So. Yeah. Because yeah. because become more complacent and more sed uh, sedentary. I think when you are in your home yeah. too much and we just don't want to be that we want to get fit and be out there and enjoy life so yeah, that's right. maybe we'll come and see some of you guys someday yeah yeah so if, uh, if anybody has any good ideas of places in uh, mm -hmm. you know the the uh, northern states or uh, even through Canada uh, we have because, a lot of places we want yeah, to get to I, I follow a photographer right now from Saskatchewan and typically anytime I go through Saskatchewan I just can't wait to be out of there because it's so flat and we know people in Saskatchewan. I know, but I'm going to go back because okay. this photographer's been to places that's phenomenal, and yeah. I didn't. It's given know, us a new, a new appreciation know, eh? for uh, yeah. Yeah, Saskatchewan. And, and that's the thing—you have an opinion, and uh, until you've been there to really yeah. see it, uh... everywhere has beauty. That's oh, what yeah. it comes down to. Yeah. And and most of the time, I think most people in their, their lives just stay on that highway and they yeah. drive from point A to point B as a, yeah. a, a, a point of getting somewhere. And we don't want to do that. We want to go off the highway. Yeah. We want to go off the beaten track and find ex exciting places and we're going to take you with us yeah. so whether yeah, you like we'll, it or not we'll, we'll be going on the off roads or the back roads and uh <laughs> yeah. you know 
Yeah, so that, that should be interesting. Did I realize? So last time you were looking down below the camera, yep. now we're looking above it. So now yep. it's going to look like we're looking here for the know. camera here. So we're here. Yep. Anyways, that's probably long enough. I yeah, don't let's know how get over long here. We've, we've got verbal. We've got lots of things to do. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's just the update. And uh, yeah, so we're doing it full time as of August. And yeah. we're going to go from there and see what happens. Yeah, and we'll give you uh, updates via, you know, uh, preparations to uh, move into here and yep. things that, uh, yep. you know, we found that we like and yeah, uh, things we're going to change. And, to, uh, yeah, little, yeah, little changes to make it yeah. uh, a good a good fit for us and, and everybody so. yeah because yep. i i've got to uh i've got to put uh, probably tomorrow I'll, I'll put in uh suspension components uh sumo uh that stuff yeah yeah i'm gonna try and do it tomorrow. tomorrow but uh anyway there's lots of things that we're gonna do to get ready to go and yep. uh it's exciting yep. it's yep. exciting and scary but whatever you know what yep. worst comes to worst eventually maybe we'll, we'll get a tiny home later maybe we'll get some little cabin later maybe we'll get some little yep. tiny apartment later we just don't want to live big we want to live small now we want to no, we want to live big in small spaces. That's what we yeah. want to do. Yeah, that's so, it. That's okay. it. We're right. going to go. Time's up. 16 minutes. What? We're, we're chatty Cathy's. Yeah, yeah. Go. Okay, bye everybody. Take care. Appreciate you watching there. us. Okay, like bye. and subscribe and all that stuff. Oh yeah, subscribe. Yeah, yeah. that helps. That yeah. helps. Yeah. yeah. Little button. Okay. And the bell. Ding that bell too. Ding dong. Don't give two thumbs up because then it goes away. Give one thumb up. Okay. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Okay, that's it. What do you think? Do you think we did okay? Is this going to record? My back is itchy. Where? You and I